Adrian. The Eagles just won and are heading to the Super Bowl and a massive consumer trend is happening. Oh my goodness. I launched an ad literally five minutes ago. Check this out. 53 people on my site right now and I'm gonna hit refresh because just within the last five minutes, it's eight orders. Right now my campaign is set on broad match for uh, keywords that you could probably guess like the underdog mask, Eagles dog mask, German shepherd mask, I'm pumped to see where this is gonna go. I don't know if I'm gonna be able to sleep tonight. Oh my gosh. Check this out. Today, sales. They're literally every few minutes. It's been going crazy since launch yesterday at like 8-ish PM. I could, my thumb is hurting. This is insane. <laughs> The Eagles are now my favorite football team. <laughs> Dude, this is nuts. Uh, since launch, 3,100 and something dollars, and it's still cracking like crazy. 10 people on the site right now just got another sale. Two hours ago, I just ordered 150 units, and I think we're gonna pass that in the next hour, it's it's only 10.39 a.m. So I'm gonna have to go back to that manufacturer and, and buy more because the thing about this product is people wanna get it in time for the Super Bowl. If they don't, there's gonna be massive refunds. Checking in, today's sales are at $2,570. Yesterday, that was at $1,530, which puts the total campaign since I launched around 10 p.m. last night at $4,113. And my spend is even crazier. This is my total spend right now. It is $642. Yes, I am using only Google Ads to do this. But what I'm actually really impressed with is the overall stats, not just the sales numbers. For such a quick campaign, literally this is 24 hours that went by. Because I launched a campaign yesterday, but it was at like 10 p.m. It is 9.47 p.m. So basically, exactly 24 hours uh, to hit this sales data. But check out some of these stats right here that are really, really awesome. So we're looking at a conversion rate of 8.23%. Sales so far are at uh, 7,700-ish dollars. This is exciting. I mean, today is, but this excitement is gonna die down here as we draw closer to uh, the Super Bowl for a couple of reasons. The main one is because this isn't drop shipping. I'm buying, or I bought, hundreds of units of the dog mask. And um, what if they don't make it here? I'm basically screwed. So, <laughs> three days later. Thank you. So relieved. Yeah, I was worried that these weren't going to arrive on time. Oh yeah, here I'll tell you. Now the most nerve-wracking part of this all is I got to open them and I got to see if they're legit because I had to act really fast on this trend and I didn't know. I didn't, I've never worked with this manufacturer before. I um, it, it's a gamble. It's a risk right now. I don't. I didn't know if these product quality was going to be good. I mean, this is the thing when you market on a time-sensitive trend is like, you have to act so fast, and if it's a new product, you're, you're, t you're there's a little bit of gambling. It's, it's definitely a risk. So let's go ahead and, and open this right now. I have some good news. I have some good news. <laughs> so now that I just got my products and they look great, the responsible thing to do would be start shipping them, but there's something very important I need to do first. units <laughs> dang crazy what's up it's 8 p.m. on a Saturday 
And basically I have all these boxes. Look at, I'm standing right now. That's how many boxes I have to fulfill. And uh, I have a couple of buddies coming over. I incentivize them with some pizza and some uh, cerveza. And the thing about um, doing self-fulfillment, uh, yeah, it's kind of annoying, but it's a good problem to have. My total sales for the campaign ended up being uh, $11,523 after a few uh, returns, but every single customer for the most part got the mask in time for the Super Bowl. Uh, my profit uh, was just about 56%, so just a little over $6,000. So why the heck am I sharing all this? Well, I think in the niche of people who are teaching online marketing, a lot of it is so smoke and mirrors, and so I wanted to document the beginning to the end of a quick campaign marketing towards a big event that everyone can relate to. Um, I'm super pumped, it ended up being very successful, and if you wanna learn how to do it, I have a really cool course, searchengineconquest.com if you wanna check it out, and every Everything I teach is actually through real campaigns just like this. If you want to learn what my product page looked like, the exact manufacturer I use, and all the costs and the ads and everything,